Good morning, Eric. It's Wednesday, and we have a problem here at the Hack 5 warehouse. We are this close to being out of coffee. I'm, I'm trying to ration the last bit here. It's not looking good. It just got worse. The moment I said that, Sarah walked in with a bag of beans. We don't have a coffee grinder. I, I, I don't know anything about making coffee. But I'm getting off buying expensive Starbucks, and that's important. And my office is coming together, slowly. So this morning I checked Twitter, as I do, and I have a feed for Wi-Fi Pineapple, because I always like to see what kind of interesting creative stuff people are doing with it. There's always people making YouTube videos and stuff that I never envisioned, and it's kind of awesome. And every now and then you see some really weird ones, and today, today was that case. You have your usual assortment of crazy emoji, which means girls are getting very excited about something. Let's see what. Oh. Hey, that's a cute t-shirt. And so it turns out that the tweet is from this big YouTuber named Meg, who I know nothing about. Uh, but I guess she has pineapple t-shirts with Wi-Fi sunglasses? Which is kind of cool. But this is the thing that I don't get, and it's what makes me feel like I really suck at social media. I don't think I've ever done one of those self-aggrandizing tweet at me, hashtag, retweet this, follow me, subscribe, and I will give you an iPhone thing. And I feel like it's a bit pedantic, and I kind of refuse, just like I refuse to do jump cuts. And it's one of those things that makes me feel a little disconnected from this community, but it's one of those things where I just, I, I don't know, maybe it's because I feel like I'm an introvert at heart, and so I never actually expected any of this to be successful, and yet at the same time, since it is, there's this expectation of society for me to be some sort of public figure who's constantly tweeting about what I had for breakfast, and I don't do that, so now I feel depressed because I'm like, oh no, I'm sucking at the thing that I'm supposed to be doing, when really I'm just trying to geek out. Pineapatosaurus agrees. And part of it makes me think that maybe, maybe the reason why I disdain this is because it's the complete opposite of what has gotten me to where I am now and whatever realm of success and however you quantify it and I think that the, like the key is and people are always like oh what's your what's your trick and I'm like well I, I don't try right and to the point where and I've tried to clarify that in different ways by saying like oh well I'm I'm just I keep my sails open for when the wind blows I'm I'm open to opportunity but really what it means is I'm just trying to keep the boat pointed in the right direction and I'm not really paddling I'm just kind of waiting I don't know how to really describe it other than to say like I don't try and I think what I mean when I say that is like I, I don't like actively a self-aggrandize and that's why I'm even having trouble with these videos and everything else but you know that is the internal conflict of me but um, but otherwise it's just like yes the success is the authenticity authenticity and the authenticity is not doing iPhone giveaways not like you know good more power to you Meg but I just I can't get behind it and then so it made me think, though, about that quote that you and I really liked um, from that video game that would play on Super Nintendo, and it was like, when you died and you, you needed to continue, and then Yoda would show up, and he would be like, Do or do not. There is no try. And um, that was a really bad Yoda, but maybe, maybe that's what Yoda meant, you know? Don't try. Just do it. And I feel like a doer or a dozer, because I do things. I don't don't do things. I do 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 things, and that's what makes the things happen. So if I try, then it's not real. I don't know. By the way, we're having a big hack five Bay Area hacker brunch the brunch brunch thing and a warehouse warming party, which means everybody can come and see the epic warehouse, which is over here. And I really wish you could be here. So hack5.org slash brunch for everyone else. And until then, I hope you're well, and I miss you. Cheers.